Hey guys, it's Rob. I'm back at you one more again. I hope you are doing good on this fantastic Friday, TGIF. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and hope the same thing for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, namaste, and love and light to you, and many blessings are yet to come. And if you can, please like and subscribe, even hit that notification button so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. And if you feel like you resonate and enjoy what you are seeing and hearing, Please drop me a line. I love positive feedback. And if you are a returning sub, thank you. Love and light and namaste to you also. And many blessings are yet to come for you too. And thank you for the love and support. Today my video is about Twin Flame 101. Are you on your soul mission? If you are, please, we need you more than ever. Guys, it's just, you don't even, sometimes you don't even know when you're on a soul mission. It's just when you're doing kindness to one another and you're pushing out so much energy, that is your soul mission. Your soul mission. It's just like, I don't know if you guys have noticed, we have a big shift. If we're not going through the Mercury, Mercury uh, things that's going on at the Mercury time with the Sagittarius and the, the, the moon of the Gemini and all these things are coming out to full force and if you have not noticed it's like with the the earthquakes and the fires and people are starting to come out in the forefront for the things that they've been doing for years to people to harm them and they're coming out and it's just like we're telling it it's like actors and you know uh you know some celebrity moguls are getting caught with like sexual harassment charges and all these bad things, it's like this is the year for all the masks to come off. And I've said that in many of my videos a long time ago, a while back, that it's just like this is the time of the year when everybody is starting to be, they, they've hit things for so many years. It's starting to come out in full force right now. So it's like we are like endangered. We're, I feel like we're endangered species. I really do. It's endangered species. And we are all on a soul mission it's like we're like earth angels walking on earth and half of us half of us don't even know we are that and it's just like when i go out and even though i could have so many different things going on it's just i don't like pushing negativity out on nobody i never do you know there's sometimes i have to you know address myself but i'll address it and just leave it alone and get on to the positive things you know because sometimes you some people need to see that just a smack them into reality and that's when the hey okay and past stops in so it's just so many different things that we're doing and we need to stay positive it's like you, you you see somebody that needs help on the side of the road if you're able to stop and help them you know if you you see somebody on the street and you know they're hungry if you could just go buy them a nice meal and not do things unapologetically you know selflessly you know, do things when you're not even expecting anything in return. That is a true blessing for me. When I know I'm able to do something for somebody and I'm not looking for anything, it, it, it warms my heart. It really does. It warms my heart. It's like the last few days, I've been telling people happy holidays, even though, I mean, I'm not with my family. And this, this, this is like the most time I want to be with my family. But... It's just like when you when you have faith and you pray that things are getting better and which I do see, you know, but it's just so much tragedy that's going on in the world. I try to be able to pay my part to society to make it a better place because it's like if we don't stop, we're not going to have an earth left. <laughs> we, if we really don't stop. We're not going to have a, a earth left. So you need to stay on your soul mission. And if you're doing things to, you know, if you're, you know, doing motivational videos like I'm doing. You know, be kind to one another. You know, if you see somebody, just, you know, tell them, hey, you know, I hope you have a blessed day and happy holidays. You know, Merry Christmas or Happy New Year's because this is coming into a new year. And it's like you're becoming a person, you know, you're on your mission and you're, you're being positive and you're pushing that out. And sometimes it can be really hard, guys, because I know your journey is not a bed of roses. I know it's not. And that's when you need to think positive, think outside the box, go with the flow. And I hear that a lot. Go with the flow. Better things are yet to come. And if we do that, it'll be like a virus. I, I like viruses like that, where you can, it can, you know, positivity can be, you know, contagious. And that's why I love doing these videos. I say this all the time. I love doing videos. I love, even right now, you see, I put this 
this picture up because it's always been sitting on this side and you couldn't see it and it just brings me so much joy and energy when I come into my 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 sanctuary I used to call this little Jamaica when I used to smoke weed but I don't smoke weed anymore so I call it my little sanctuary can't call it little Jamaica anymore <laughs> so even though I would love to go to little Jamaica I mean actually Jamaica you know just to be on the sand and the beach and you know see the beautiful colors and you know taste the you know you know exotic fruit and stuff like that you know I I just have it all around me right now it's just like spirituality and angels all around I have all my Catholic candles here and you know I usually light those at night right now I got my white candles going you know just to push out energy white energy you know send out love send out light to people because we truly need it. There are so many unhappy souls right now. And it's just like, I want to pay my part to the, to the world. Even though I'm not where I want to be at, I'm content. Because I know things are getting better. You know, I have that faith that God, God didn't bring me this far to abandon me. He didn't. You know, this is my sole mission. If I want what I want, I have to do my part in life. And there's things that we want so desperately, you know. And it, it's just like, you can't have them handed to you. That means that's when you step in and do your part for the world stay on your soul mission you know you see somebody have a blessed day you know if you know whatever religion you have shalom you know namaste you know love and light you know you send out all that positive energy and it's just like right now I'm so emotional and try not to cry but it's a good feeling you know it's a good feeling when you feel like you know you love yourself more you know, you when you love yourself more and you're able to see a big picture with people. And it's just sometimes we're so busy to not notice the things that are around us that we should be so fortunate about. Because it can always be a lot worse. You know, and I've said that in different videos too. You know, we go through things and we complain about stuff. You know, right now my washer's broke. <laughs> Refrigerator acting up. But you know what? Hey, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? We all gonna go through stuff like that. We all gonna go through it. And it's just like, guys, when you when when you're going through stuff like that, pray, meditate, do whatever you need to do, as long as it's positive. You know what I'm saying? As long as it's positive. Get yourself in that mind state where you know things are coming. It might not be you're not right where you need to be, right where where you wanna be right now. But you're right where you need to be at this time. There's nothing, you've gone through things, you're going to have the failures, you're going to have the bumps, you're going to have the bruises, the battles, and the wars. But that can be your story, the truth, your testimony, you'll be able to preach to somebody one day. You know, when I pull these videos out, you know, yes, I had abandonment issues. Yes, my my adopted father and his, his wife and their family knew everything that was going on around me and still don't want to say anything. But you know what, I'm glad I went through everything I went through because it brought me here you know I'm healing you know and it's hard there's times you know I see my dad's pictures all the time and I just know things are okay you know things are okay and everything's gonna be fine you know I think that in my mindset I step the leap out on faith just to know things are gonna get better for me and they're gonna get better for you too but you have to have that in your mind that you know that things are going to be better and so do your parts of society Stay on your soul mission because we need it so much right now. And I'm not trying to hold you guys up. You know, I'm trying to push out this love and light. I'm just so zenful today. And I'm listening to um, Angel Healing, relaxing music for healing dreams, lucid dreaming, and sleep and breathing meditation. And I'll put that on the link below in case you need a meditation. Um, and this goes on for an hour and 22 minutes or so. So... You know, if you're, you know, you want to take a nap for an hour or something like this, this is so relaxing. And it just feels like I'm in a spa, having a mimosa, and just kicking it with a couple of girlfriends. <laughs> so, you guys have a blessed weekend, and I will holler at you on my next video. And if you can, you know, tell somebody, you know, have a blessed day. Happy holidays. You know, it'll make you feel good a little bit. And I will talk to you later. And please like and subscribe. Even hit that, that bell. And even drop me a line if you feel free. Peace. And be wild. And you guys will definitely stay in my prayers. Bye.